Greetings and welcome back to Clan Folk. I'm Catherine of Sky and I love this game. I absolutely love this game. Uh, and we are proceeding well apace. Um, I feel like we're doing really well. Bess is here. I think we're going to send her away. At least I think it's her. I'm, I'm assuming Bess is like Elizabeth kind of name. I don't know. Water jugs are needed for what? Bathtub. Okay. Flax sheaves. It's interesting to me. Uh, do we have any... Uh, I guess we don't have any plain jugs. I feel like we probably need to just warm up some jugs. Let's warm up like five jugs and that should be enough. All right. We do need some bricks for this oven here. We also need this window done. Let's go ahead and knock that window just to get some light in here. Uh, I really like when we have a little bit of light. Um, we can also, let me look at building. I haven't built a lot of, uh, torches yet. I feel like, I don't know. They're kind of dangerous. Let's see. Standing torch. Does it tell us? It does, should tell us that it throws sparks. No. I wish there was a thing that would tell us if we're throwing sparks. You know what? I am also going to write that down. Tell us if it throws sparks. Okay. I have these like lists and, um, I'm actually quite ahead in recording. So this will likely, if, if changes are made, if you know, the developer likes the suggestions, of course he might add things, but, um, yeah, we're gonna, it will be added probably long before now. Um, but yeah, I, I, I like to record ahead because I like to have my own strategy and stuff like that. I find it fun to do that. Uh, don't mind hearing suggestions. Of course, uh, everybody has their own strategy. Um, but I like to kind of go and do mine first without, uh, relying on other people's suggestions at the time. Um, anyway, so we have a standing torch. I'm kind of afraid of the whole, oh, this one throws sparks. Oh, it does say, look at the bottom. It is on the bottom. Oh, why do we not have something like a hearth that does not throw sparks? Mm. All right. You know what? We'll just do a one wall torch over here. And, uh, that would be good enough. Now, I guess we're supposed to, we probably should have things, but I really don't want to add heat sources in here. I guess it wouldn't be too horrible because this is really cold. This area here, look at it's like minus six. This is fantastic. I don't think it's ever going to warm up in here. This is great. What do we have here? Oat grain. Why did they just not put it in the palette? Like this is, this is like, you know, kids. Uh, and one reason I don't like kids is because they like, you know, they don't, there's a toy box right there and yet they insist on throwing it on the floor. You know what I mean? It, and some people with their socks and laundry and whatnot, adults do this too. It's not just kids, but, um, I'm just making an example. Uh, anyway, so I think, did we get any berries? We have t two berries. I thought we would have finished all of these berry, uh, thinking so unless they're just eating them first. I don't know what's going on with the berries. All right, we dry, dry hide needed for fur cloaks, hats, and tunics. Iron ore needed desperately, and I don't think we have any. Now, we were supposed to mine this. Guess what? That vein did not continue into the mountain. Um, I think what I might do, though, is I might just do some kind of, like, a cross-shaped thing here uh, just to see if we can find some iron ore hidden in these mountains. Maybe there is some. Uh, but otherwise, I don't really know what to do about that. Um, all right. Anyway, let's go ahead and gather some berries. Uh, there are some over here. I feel like we're going further and further afield to gather these darn berries. All right. You go ahead and knock that. All right. That's good. And it is morning. So let me see. We wanted to catch some animals. Uh, so temperature. Where are the animals today? There's one here. Okay. One here and up here. All right. So they are quite far away, but... It is summertime, no slog through the snow. It should be fine. Okay, it looks like they gathered some of the material here, but I want them to gather a little bit more. Uh, yeah, we're just not really gathering anything like from, from a uh, cutting grass point of view. Okay, so Lachlan is now working on this oven. That is perfect. We definitely want that to happen. All right, so we have a bread oven. 
I'm not really sure how this happens, actually. Do we just get the flower and they just automatically do stuff? Look at how much that window brightened things up. That is so nice. I guess that's what happens. I guess they just automatically bake because there's no recipe that I see here. Do we have it? In, is it in the ideas chart here, maybe? I'm kind of confused why there's not like a make X amount of bread thing. Okay, so there is a chamber pot, a grain trough. What do we do for this? Milk. Oh, we don't have any animals yet. Add fertilizer. That's the thing that we need to do. Butter churn has also not been done. Um, that needs milking, of course. Yeah, we don't have that at all yet. Mm. Spinning wheel. That also needs... Oh, it needs flax fibers. Okay, so we just need those flax fibers and we can unlock the spinning wheel. All right. So that's good. So I guess we're gathering berries today mostly. That's what our clan is doing. And I'm hoping that they're just going to do these darn bushes. I really want them to do them. Come on, folks. Do the bushes, please. Just knock them all out. All right. Two traders. We have merit. Yeah, I'll take your iron ore, please. We have leather. One for eight. That's pretty valuable. We've got the smoked meat. And we, we can also sell these items, but those are far too valuable for us. All right. So you go. We've done with you. Now you will buy our bricks and stuff, but I don't want to sell any of that. Okay, I think we're then good. Hooray. Okay, you go. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Whoops. Go. Thank you. Thank you. I do want to hire a new person in the morning if we possibly can. That would be good. So we have a door now. I want to, uh, we have this at, we're going to put this at 10 and I only want to have ice jugs here. This is the only thing I want to have. So let's go over here and empty one of these pallets. Or at least take... Let's take a couple off. Let's take uh, five off. So I'm just going to select these this way. Excuse me. Thank you. No. No mining gravel. Stop that. And then we're going to knock them. Good. All right. Very good. So that means they should be collected in this room. And so this is our food. Hopefully they're going to haul some food into here. I will go ahead and put in an object as in a food storage thing. Um, it's called pantry shelves. Nice. Uh, we'll put that right by the door there. I think that'll be a nice thing uh, for them to, to get later. So let's see. Did we... Okay, Kristen is putting some of these bushes in. Oh my god, it's been a struggle to get enough berries. It feels like like we harvest 10 bushes and they make three. I'm not really getting this, understanding this at all. Maybe she has put the seeds in the ground and she's just planting them. It looks like that's exactly what she's doing, actually. Uh, let's see, this grain needs to be hauled. This grain needs to be hauled. I wonder if the reason they didn't dump it here... It's nine, and this is eight. So no, they should have dumped it in the grain pallet. I'm not really getting why they're not doing this. Don't don't get it at all. All right, anyway, it's fine. We now have plenty of water for the bathtub. The alert is not uh, alerting us, so that's good. One thing that I really like about this game is the alert system because there are so many processes going on here that it's quite easy to miss something and overlook something not getting crafted or whatever. It's just so nice to have these things, and some of them, like, what, what, what's going on here, you know? Okay, so let's get these chamber pots. Can I... Hello? Full chamber pot. Priority boost this. I think what they're going to do is put them in the compost bin. So that should be a level 10 job. Oh no, they put them in here. Uh... I'm so confused right now. I don't... <laughs> I don't understand this. Why are they here? I thought they would get dumped into here. All right, fine. I'll just click them and dump them. And yeah, they'll just, we'll just have dirt on the ground there. Or poop on the ground. Yay. Yay. Okay. Um, one thing that we can do here is we do have the lighting here. This is, is this a wood wall? It looks like a wood wall. I think I would like to replace this with a brick wall here. 
Uh, this has a vent in it, I guess. But I was thinking about something like the, um, the light going here in case it throws the sparks. Let's see. Uh, all right. I want to get this one in. Wall torch. See, see what the sparks are like. Is it just forward or is it all around it? Isabel, what you doing, girl? Wait. Oh, never mind. I'm just, I'm not thinking. Alrighty. So, wall torch has been installed. We're going to see what that's like later. Okay. Lachlan is cooking something. Good. Cook deal. I'll, I am, I'm in favor of this. And of course, all of this cook deal has not been hauled. I hate that they don't do this. It drives me a bit crazy. It's like, why don't they do it? And it's almost dying. Like, what is going on here? This is so infuriating. This, like, they don't haul it at all. And I do have somebody hauling. Hutchin should do it all after hunting. Oh, there's no more hunting for today, for sure. And yet he's not hauling any of this. This is, it's going to go to waste. And it's very sad. Not good. It makes me feel like I should put the kitchen in this room here. And Lisa's just standing there, meowing over it. Wonderful. That was very, very useful. This should also be hauled. These eels. I don't know why they're just like raw eels outside. Why? That should be in the fridge. These people seem to have these like really strange ideas of... Oh, yes, let's just catch this valuable food and then, like, toss it on the ground. Why? What is the point of having it in the middle of the, like, literally the middle of the pathway? It doesn't do anything there. They haven't stopped to eat or drink or sleep. They just dropped it. So I don't know what's going on here with that. But I hope they fix it before those eels go bad, because that ain't good. Makes the KOS very unhappy about the situation. All right, what do we have in our inventory? I want to check. I want. I keep wanting to check the branches and the um, all the other stuff that we need. Uh, all right, we're. Oops. So we have plenty of straw. We have uh, not enough logs. We definitely need to cut these logs today. Uh, I think we're going to put those on priority because I want to get them cut before the winter sets in. Obviously we still have all of fall to do this, but you never can be too careful with this. Also, we now have nothing to do over here. We can't plant anything. So life is sad in no planting land. I'm going to go ahead and take these off priority because, uh, it's just, I don't want it to mess with their internal chron chronometers. Um, there we go. Take it off priority and just have them do things that actually um, or have, have the alerts for them actually doing stuff because they can't plant. Uh, all right, there we go. Oh, this is great. Okay. So we have two cutters right now. They're working really hard on these logs. I think I'm going to also, um, command hauling of logs, uh, via the, the Znock. This area is very sad. I'm going to have to really plant this with a grove of trees in the summer and put them on high priority because this is a bit ridiculous. This is not good. All right, here we go. Okay, did they haul these items? No, of course they didn't. Why would they? Oh my God, people. Why you do? What is this? This is gold. Why is there gold here? I think I'm going to have a gold pile out back maybe. Let's put in a general let's put a general pile right out here and this is just going to be toggle all off and then we're going to put gold in here because gold doesn't have its own storage right now uh so yeah it needs to have something all right let's go ahead and haul all these logs back want that to get done for sure um i'm also going to do some orders for mushroom uh collection. There we go. These snares are still here, but I don't know if they ever get used, to be honest. I, I have no idea. Okay, and the branches also. I'm going to also do a, an order to haul the branches. There we go. 443. That seems like a lot. Okay. Let's get some more mushrooms from over here. 
But the thing about it is, is that when, when somebody, and I think this is how it works, I'm not like 100%, but I believe this is how it works. Somebody goes to make a tiny bit of charcoal. They go out and get three branches or however many is needed. How many is needed? Uh, let's find out. Uh, oh, wait. Um, okay. Looks like we didn't get our charcoal kin kilns completely packed yet, or we did. And I forgot to put them out. That's not good. Oh dear. Uh, okay, so we'll put those there and then we'll pack this one up. Anyway, uh, when they make a piece of something, say this iron ingot, uh, well, not the iron ingot, the charcoal, they go and get one branch and they bring it back and they craft it. But the haulers, they carry a whole armful of stuff back and it really works a lot better. Let's see, jobs, also more mushrooms. There's a lot of mushrooms uh, perking up and, and starting to grow next to uh, these tree trunks, the stumps. Uh, it's it's kind of nice. It's kind of great, yes. All right, so things are happening. Stuff is going. That's great. Yeah, and we haven't even, we haven't seen any uh, merchants that have been selling any chickens or animals. That is another thing that I really would like to get back into because right now we don't have any animals. And that was kind of a fail-safe uh, condition. Uh, last winter, we could have just slaughtered one of the chickens for food. Um, but I'm not really worried about it. We actually have 19 days of food in a frozen zone. So yeah, going pretty well. I think, so this is at level 10. I don't know why they haven't hauled these. Oh, because these are also level 10. Oh dear. Okay, those are gonna be level nine and we're gonna have to, let's, uh, yeah, take one apart and then I'm gonna collect those again and have them hauled again. That was my bad. I thought I changed those to be lower, but no. That, was, they're like, KOS, really? What are you doing here? Oh, some first, first amount of gold has appeared in the gold pile, that is great. Okay. Things are happening. Stuff is going. And we are getting some smoked stuff. I'm going to have that hauled as well. I'm going to have to keep an eye on this kitchen. Um, I don't know what to do. Whether I should put a blocker so that they have to carry it. But what if they dump it outside? That's even worse, I think, because it's not even under shelter. All right, we have a traveler. Hendry. Hendry. Here, stay here. You also stay here. Nice. So we have Katrin and Hendry. Rent due 24, and this one is also 24. Maybe they increase that rent as they uh, they eat and all that kind of stuff. Okay, let's go. Go, go, go. We're doing stuff. It's just taking a while. They still haven't used this uh, torch, though. I'm kind of surprised about that. They haven't turned it on. I guess that's the job of the repair person, I believe. Yeah, wall torch repair. Okay. I'm going to take this off. Actually, no. Yeah, we probably don't need that to be on right now. Um, this probably also will not function because we don't have stuff. Do we need... To, I. You know what? I should make a one gold ingot. Uh, just to see if they need to do stuff with that. Take this one off and put the gold in. And these guys always are in need of stuff. We're always in need of bricks and stuff. Clay, we have 220, so that means we need to go and get more clay. Jobs, we're going to... Oh, and this poor fish did not get eaten. That's what drives me crazy sometimes about things is like... I don't know, maybe I'm putting too many things on priority, so they're all, like, focused on doing these priority things, but I'll, I'll take them off. I'll take them off and see if they do, like, a natural job with their tasks and stuff. This thing, I'll put that off snock. It is a high priority, so they should do stuff there. Um, I am afraid of that one because that is creating our branches for us, and the branches are what enables us to cook everything. It's used in cooking, uh, five branches for each uh, set of eels that's cooked. So that's quite important. And they left them on the floor. Thank you very much. That's great. Dude. Dude.
but I wonder if I should just leave the cooking to the cook as well, because we do should have, we have Kristen who is supposed to cook uh, all the time. So maybe I'll take that off Snock as well. All right, finally taking them into the cold storage and putting them on this lovely shelf that we have here. It does look like they hauled the other stuff there. So that's good, but it looks like there is no food in here, is there? There's a snare kit. That sounds very edible. <laughs> that's like, what? It's very weird. Okay. Looks like Huchon is doing the repair work, just putting fires everywhere. Putting branches in these fires and stuff. Kind of cool. Okay, let's see. I'm going to watch this throw sparks and see where they go. It does provide some nice light, um, but I am worried a bit about the sparks. So let's see where they are going to appear. Pardon me if I stare into the light for a very long time. <laughs> oh dear. It could be that it only throws forward. I don't know. Oh no, it's to the side as well. So it is like a cooking fire. So you have to... That That's one of the things I don't like about the lights that... The light technology that I have right now is that it basically... Uh, you have to have all this real estate around this one light. And it doesn't seem useful. Like here, I have to block off this entire corner and not put anything there that would be able to catch fire. Maybe I should put these in, the meat smokers. I could move those there and use up those spaces. Um, but then again, we have the branch pile over here, which is needed for the smoking. So I feel like having them there is much more beneficial. Okay, let's see. Nobody is doing mushrooming stuff. A bit surprised about that. Okay, let's see. We have a trader or two. I'm going to go ahead and buy the branches. Uh, they aren't very friendly to us, but that's okay. I mean, the prices are not great. We have chick... You know what? We have eggs. Maybe we should buy an egg or two. Maybe we can hatch them. I don't know if we eat them or hatch them. Oh my god, there's six of them? Oh, I didn't mean to buy six. I thought it was... Oh, I got confused. I thought it was one for six gold. But may, was it one gold for six eggs? I don't really know what's happening with this. Anyway, let's see if we can haul these guys. Um, they are... I don't know if we can possibly incubate them. I'm not sure how that works. Like, could they put this on a bed and just warm it up with a cat or something? Put the cat on top? Well, they don't have any cats, but I would love to have a cat to just, like, warm up the eggs. Um, I don't know how that works, really. All right. Anyway. Uh, eels, as always, need hauling. Wait. This jug is upside down. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to take a screenshot of this. This is hilarious. Okay, jug upside down. I need to write that down because that's... <laughs> I don't think that should happen. Even the number is upside down. How does that happen? <laughs> I, I, I guess KOS has broken the game again. Oh my god. I'm so good at that. I'm really good at that. And it's okay. It's okay to be good at things that that help with stuff. I hope. Okay, uh, rabbit. Sorry, rabbit. You walked across my field of view and therefore we must delete you. Anyway, that is bizarre, the upside down thing. I wonder how that even happened. How is that even a thing? Alrighty, this is looking fabulous. I want to go grab, selecting all these mushrooms here. Go ahead and haul them. Oops. Let's move that out of the frame. There we go. We can haul these. Oops. I guess there's supposedly more somewhere. More mushrooms. Go, go. All right, and we are drying some mushrooms, giving us 24 days of food. I think that the first year is just freaking hard because you don't have the fridge working. You have to constantly, you know, get these eels and do other things. I think, I think after you survive year one, you're kind of set. I feel like I'm very set with stuff. I mean, obviously we're still making things, but it's, uh, it's a lot better. I do feel the pressure, though, of having no iron. That is such a big problem. And, like, we aren't 
getting people selling it to us either. So that feels very bad. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can prioritize this area here and then get these columns going on. So it does look like they have built a lot of the roof around the buildings. Uh, and that's great because um, that'll help them with, you know, just keeping things nice. Okay, here we're getting some roof done. Good, good. But yeah, here they're going to have a shaded path in the spring and then a free, hopefully free of snow path in the winter, which is going to be kind of great. Um, in here, I think I would also like to put in a path here. Let's see, flooring. I like the brick floor uh, for the outside for sure. Um, let's put this this way and then maybe we we'll put something, plant something or decoration something over there. Um, yeah. And I'm wondering, maybe we should upgrade this path as well. Because they, it is a very well-traveled path and now we have the abilities to, you know, produce better, better things. So let's just upgrade this and we shall also just kind of make a little line here to connect to these eel traps and such. But we do have our priorities over here, so very happy about that. Let's see, can I go like this and just do this and say not? Yeah, there we go. Okay, perfect. I love how this system works of like, if it's not on screen, it doesn't get prioritized. Because you saw what I did. I did like this surgical precision of do not do these things. I mean, I think she was already on her way. But yeah. Okay, chamber pots needed. Really? Again? I am finding maybe the poop hole is a better, better thing to have. Uh, whoops. We want to have um, dump. And there's the other one. Dump. Oh, this is the clean one. Um, okay. Let's see. Inventory. Oh, we have more crates as well. Oh, dear. Yeah, we have probably... Oh, these haven't been put in yet? Come on, dudes. Let's go. Put them in. Go, go, go. Also, we need windows on this side of things as well. So we need to make a... Let's do a wood window right there. Why can I not put it there? I don't know. Okay, let's do it there then. Uh, go ahead and knock it. Yep. Because it does get very dark in these spaces. I don't... Do we have a window? I think they're all on the front side of the room, really. What we can do is actually uh, delete these windows. These... And get some materials back from them. Because they are not useful, obviously. And they don't do anything. They just make... Uh, they're just a window into the next room. But do we have a vent? I don't think so. Let's make a vent. We need a fireproof vent. I like using the fireproof. I don't care. I'm just going to use it. It's, yeah. Nope. Okay, that was my bad. I, I did a wrong thing there. Um, Actually, well, no, this is right. Uh, well, we could do this right here. And charcoal kilns don't throw f sparks, and this doesn't have any sparks. So that should be just fine, actually. All right. Um, it looks like outside it is starting to get a little bit cooler. And it's time to... Time to start the fires now. And there's still no children. Are we... Our mood is not very... Well, we're jolly. Finds fun everywhere. Hooray. But the mood is... Let's see. Sackcloth bottoms, well-fed, fur tunic. It's wearing clothes. I feel, maybe, they should just go naked. Um, yeah. I think that's probably a thing. Why is she lonely? Like she has, she has a husband. She can, she can do things with him. I'm not sure what, what the problem is with the loneliness. I do think I want to build this serving table. That might get us some like group fooding options. I'm not sure, but we'll see. All right, let's go ahead and uh, try to select these, anything logs uh, on this page here. Are there branches out here? I don't think so. I think everything looks pretty pretty well taken care of. The mushroom racks are drying well. Oh dear, we have some issues here. What is going on? Oh my god. Uh, what happened? Alright. Uh, okay, butcher block. We're gonna move this to here. Okay, and we'll just put that on Znock. 
And we will put this one on Znok. I don't know what the heck happened there. Maybe we need to move this bark. Okay, flammable blocker. Okay. Sure. I didn't think it could travel sideways like that. But yeah, I do want to clean up some of this blood on the ground. We also have these, dust. We have a trader. Let's look at the traders, what they have. All right, we have iron ore here. That's good. Something at least. And you have hay. All right, not interested. What did we do with the eggs? Is it food? They're in the freezer. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> They're never going to incubate in the freezer. No. Can I... Wait, these things are chicken beds, but I don't think they put them on the chicken beds. That was my idea, was that they were going to get these and incubate them and it's going to be fine. But nope, apparently not. All right, let's see. We have the charcoal kilns available there. We should have another box of one. Box of a charcoal kiln. kiln. There we go. Okay, unpack and place right there. Let's get this coal bin also moved. Let's go knock here and knock there. Get that going. All right, folks. Murdoch is still here. Go ahead and go away. Bye bye. Uh, this roof is getting built quite nicely. I'm very happy about that. Of course, these things are still on the floor. I really don't know why food is at such a low priority. That drives me crazy. I really wish I could change that so that, like, it's number nine. We really want it number nine because number nine means they're going to haul it first. I do have haulers. We should be able to do this. And I don't understand why they're not doing it. Okay, let's see. We have many things going on here. Isabel's collecting the eels from the traps. And there are some outside here. Wonderful. Yay. Not good, people. Don't leave stuff out here, please. Okay, there is a wild animal who appeared on my radar just now. Okay, good. We are doing these other tasks slowly as well. The collecting of mushrooms and such. Lisa. What is Lisa doing? Building? Oh, she's. I thought she was carrying a baby for a moment there. I was like, huh. Interesting. Okay. All right. So she's going to put those mushrooms on the drying rack. Hooray. Yay for progress. That is happy. Happy for us. All right. Chamber pot needed. Oh my God. This chamber pot dilemma is really not ideal. Let's just empty this one. I'm going to dismantle this. I just want to have a poop hole here. It's so much better. I think. I don't know if it's better, but it seems better. Do we have any kind of like, I don't know, pleasure signs? That sounded bad, but uh, floor mats? Used to keep floor clean, but they are minus. I don't get that. This doesn't give any room score. Okay. Water dipper we have inside, I believe, right? Yeah, it's right there. And the well is just outside. Also, I don't know why we don't have... Uh, extra stuff in the other room. I'm going to go ahead and take some food from the pantry. Uh, well, actually, I don't understand why this thing... So this food section is level 10. This food section, what level is this? Level 8. Pantry, level 9. Why is this not getting filled with food? I don't understand that. I don't get it. This is a water jug. We do not have water jugs here. Go away. These are only ice. Do not want regular jugs in here. They're melting. This is bad. Well, not, not, not a lot, but they are slightly melting. We need to... Um, what is the temperature in here? It's still minus 6. But I don't know. They're just not, not happening. This is great, though. We now have a walkway in the snow for the snow that hopefully they'll at least be able to walk faster and not have to trudge through the snow, even if they are still cold. We could connect these uh, with large rooms, and maybe that's the next step for this. 
We could just make another large room connecting this. Maybe we could even make some bedrooms in here. Maybe there's a corridor that goes from one place to another. Maybe that's what we should do. Okay, so Lachlan and Elizabeth, Isabel. I really would like them to get a bit frisky here. Can y'all guys frisk, please? <laughs> frisk! Come on, time to frisk! <laughs> dear. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Okay, 12x speed. Let's go, go, go. Hochon is sleeping over there. That is weird. Okay, why don't you go there instead? You sleep there instead. Would like to get these rooms made as well. This uh, walkway is getting built to my delight. Yay. I mean, yay. Mm. Okay, Lisa's digging some clay over there. People getting eels. I'm going to go ahead and also get more wild animals because we need these furs very much so. There's one. We got that one. Got that one. Just not really seeing them. Oh, wait, there's a helper here. Hello? Okay, who's here? Christopher. Hey, Christopher. How much do you want per day? 33 a day. That's pretty cheap. All right, let's see what you can do, Christopher. I want you to do first. Let's go hunting. And then I want you to do, I guess, planting, gathering, more gathering, and then maybe crafting. Sure. Okay, good. Go. Do your thing, Christopher. Man, I can't believe that other gal just left. Oh my god, look what we found! Oh, the iron is so sexy. Look at that. Hey, Christopher. Hi, hi. We got some mining for you to do, bro. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Okay, so I want you to clear all of this lovely mining. Um, and just... We're just going to carefully mine out the iron ore... Um, and just kind of tend this as he mines out more and more of this stuff. We have 19 days still of food. This is kind of great. Uh, this is a bit of a disaster. I, in my, in my, my test colonies, I had two fields like this size or bigger even, and they were completely, you know, dug and planted by the first year winter. And this is just like, oh God. But it's been priorities. I really need these people to frisk because uh, there's no children happening. And I don't understand why they're not socialing. What is going on with the social? It might be they need a serving table with like chairs and stuff. Maybe we need a dining room. There's room in here to have a dining room if we want. So that is a possibility. I'm going to also take these things. Just put this hay away. Put this away. Uh, let's see. Go ahead and, yeah, just put it where it goes, people. And then the water, these water things, I think we should put them. What we can do is have a pallet for water in this room. Oh, we do have one. Nice. Okay, that's only regular water jugs. Perfect. So that, that seems great. Great, great, great. There's still no food in the fridge over there, even though it should be cold. It is 3.5 uh, Celsius. They don't have their full amount of water jugs, alas. We really need to get more in there. So apparently these got forgotten. So we want to take those out. We also want to get these guys out. I don't know why some of them are unselectable. The sideways ones are unselectable. But what we're going to do is take this food thing and take off water jugs... Uh, and ice jugs as well. And also the grains. I want the grains off the ground. The rest, sure, they can put stuff in here, I guess. But yeah. All right, get this one out of here. I don't know what this one is doing sideways. This one also. There we go. Okay, we got the eels in here too. Which is good. But yeah, they haven't been cooked. Are we... What's going on with the eels? Maybe we just have too many. We don't have too many. We need to have more. Let's cook all of them. Just cook every eel we have, people. 
Cooked meat is off. Cooked fish is also off. Um, I'm not sure what's supposed to happen with this thing. I guess we haven't made any bread yet. I don't recall seeing any. Lisa is doing stuff. Okay. So need more bathrooms. All right, let's make a poop hole. That's what we wanted to do. There we go. Put that in. Hooray. Okay, good. So there's all this clothes strewn about. I kind of want to get these wardrobes done so that we can put some of it away. It's uh, a bit, yeah, not ideal to have it like all over the landscape. I don't like that part of it. But right now we're really suffering under a lack, very big lack of iron ore. So where is Christopher working? R really? What are you doing, Christopher? Quarrying stone. Oh, he's doing this. Oh, geez. I don't want you to do this. I really want you to do this over here, please. This is also a task at level five important. So I'm going to put that at level six so he can say, aha, they want me to mine mountains. Let's go. <laughs> but I guess we just didn't have enough stone. Um, yeah, we're at 17 of 40. We don't really have a full-time miner right now. I'm so, I really want our people to, um, to have more children because we need workforce, man. That is what children are for. Put them to work. Absolutely. Okay. Lachlan working on this roof over here. Um, Lisa gathering, hooch on hunting, people sleeping, Christopher working still. That's great. Oh, and we have some skins in here. I guess those can go... Oh, right. Oh, no. I was gonna leave the skins... Something went very wrong. The skins should go... The, the butcher block should go there, not here. I don't know why, what I was thinking. All right, that needs to be packed again. But we are getting skins, and that's good. They're going to get dried on the racks, and we can keep on hunting all these lovely little bunnies. Let's go. We might want to put some snare traps in. I don't know if that's faster. I guess it might be, especially uh, with the close, uh, close uh, rabbit holes. Let's see, hunting. Let's get the snares. Actually, we can surround the rabbit hole with these snares. Are there any other good rabbit holes around? I think that, yeah, here's one. Let's do these. All right. Um, these bushes still haven't given us berries yet. They were planted last year. I dread the trees. Like, how many years is it going to take to grow a tree? We might be reliant on visitors for the trees and wood and stuff. And that scares me. That really scares me. Let's see. How, what do we have for our inventory here? Let's see. Ingredients. We have 488 branches, 158 logs. That's pretty great. Now remember each log makes 20 branches. So you can kind of, I think it's 20, right? Let's look. Yep. 20, one log makes 20 branches. So we can multiply this by 20 to get the total amount of branches. Though some people are going to make plank, obviously. Uh, but we're doing pretty well, I think. We've got five gold ingots. Okay, nice. Um, we didn't get any unlocks from that. And that that's that's expected because I I think I told you the other day that um, they there's no use for gold yet. Um, but I thought still maybe there's something to unlock. I don't know. Anyway, Huchon, what are you doing? What you doing? Just making sure these people have stuff to do. Sin is warming up. Okay. Uchan is washing. Very good. Very good. Gonna go have some fun here. Yay. Um, also, flammable blocker right here. That's a bit... Like, move this, please. See, is this happy? Looks like this is a very happy room. Room 500. This room is 855. 
This room is 1850. This one is minus 55. I think we might need to change the flooring in here because it is kind of not happy for our people. So let us, okay, we are still lacking in the tiles there. I guess we need to make more tiles. So let's just plan a hundred more tiles. That should be enough for three squares. One square of tile is five. Yeah, so that's more than enough. Um, and then brick. Yeah, we need a lot of brick. We're going to need a lot of brick. So keep on making the brick all the time. So now they have actually done some of their jobs, which is kind of good. Uh, but there are still other things that we need to organize here. Oh, wow. Christopher is digging up this mountain. Look at him go. Let's see. Let's go ahead and get mine mountains over here. More, more, more. We can always use more iron ore. Traders are here. Not going to buy berries. Uh, sticks. Yeah, it's cheap for very, you know, ready-made sticks. They have eels. Uh, they have eggs. Well, we, we figured we can't hatch an egg, alas. So we have lots of hay. I might just sell them some hay because we have tons and we have no animals to feed. So that's fine. Yeah, I think we're pretty good otherwise. Yep, that'll work. All right, you are working it. My dude. Mine mountains. There we go. All right, we already talked to the traders. Very good. Snare kits needed. Yep, they can make those later. But yeah, we need more, more tiles. I think we can do... What if we did even a small tile floor? That would probably make them a little bit happy. Let's see, what are we looking at for that? So the fancy wood and the fancy tile. So tile only needs clay. We don't need nails. So we need to not use the fancy wood floor. I feel like we've wasted a lot on that. A lot of nails. Uh, this is 10, this is 20. So I'm going to make, just put in a little bit of flooring here and see how well that uh, room score goes up. And then these folks, uh, we're also, let's do the same thing over here uh, while we're remembering about it. Let's have fancy tile floors in here. Uh, let's just do a line that way and then fill in the room. Yep. Okay, great. There we go. Isabel's working to delete the mushrooms and stuff there. Let's see, Malcolm is here. All right, let's send you off. There you go. 20 days of food right now. It's pretty great. 20 days of food is nice. Oh my gosh, they're just putting down this floor. Look at that. All right, let's get our happiness score again. Now the room's at 225. So that should really, really affect our uh, people. Let's do the same in this room. Just put a few tiles down just to kind of make them happy, you know, just like, oh, wow, there is a thing here. Let's take a bath in here. I kind of feel like making a, a proper bathroom as well uh, where they can have nice uh, things. Fancy tile floor. Let's go there and we'll just do like three rows. Um, we could do that here. Why don't we do that actually? Let's make some walls that are impressive. Stone block is five, alas. Wood wall is, oopsies, what's going on? Game? What? Okay, that's the first crash that I've had. That was weird. It was it like the game like lagged for a second. Oh, whoops, let's, uh, seems unable to sync. All right, let's try again. All right, let's go. Um, that's the very first crash I've had in this game. Otherwise it's been playing completely smoothly. I had a lag spike there where I, you could probably see things going a little bit slow. So let's see the last timed save and where that gets us. I hope it's not too far back. Okay. So it's just before we put in the floor here, I think. So let's just do that. Uh, also, just be aware if you're not familiar with early access games, this is quite, uh, quite regular, quite usual, very expected for this to happen. So 
No need to, to freak out or, oh my god, the game is whatever. No, the game is in early access and having bugs is expected. So um, I don't know what happened there, but we have the save and it looks looking okay. So I think what I'm going to do is let's make some more tiles here. And then here we'll make a whole bunch of bricks. We're making already a whole bunch of bricks. I think we're probably needing clay, maybe. Let's see, clay, we have 630, but you know what? You never can have too much clay. This is what I'm learning. Also, nobody cares about hauling fish, apparently. This is just a travesty. They just never haul it. It's horrible. I'm like, people, hello. Also, look at all these mushrooms. Wait, it's doing it again. <gasps> no! All right, so something is up with this. Um, I'm going to try to just get back to where we were. I'm hoping it will work. Let's see. Load game. This is highly unusual, by the way. I've played this game for quite a few hours now. Let me just check Steam and I'll tell you. Uh, 35 hours. And these are the first crash, actual crashes that I've had. Uh, okay, it did take us back to here. Objects. Uh, mm, let's go back to buildings. We'll do our, oh yeah, we need to increase the tiles that we're making here and we'll do our buildings tiled floor, a fancy tile floor. Yes. And we were going to do a bathroom, but let's quick save the game. Uh, here we were going to gather mushrooms. I'm not sure what's going on with this. I am going to send the developer my save right after we finish this, like where I saved there, or the time save, I should say. Um, oh, they, they processed the bunny. Hooray. Anyway, um, yeah. Wait, actually, the corpses should go where? Oh, here is good. Here is good. Oh, okay. You know what? We're going to stop this episode here, apparently. So anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and we'll get this fixed next time. Bye-bye.